guys, welcome back to some more AFK Arena. Today we're on the test server on our free-to-play account, 35-28. Um, we're trying to make a little bit more progression in here, but first we want to do some summons. So I haven't summoned actually on a little for a little bit on this account. Um, we're getting ready for the Abyssal Expedition, which is taking off tomorrow. So we want to make some summons on here. Um, hopefully we can pick up a couple of the new heroes. Going to use some of the cards, try and pick up Aziz, um, seeing if we can get him to that Elite Plus status. Um, or actually if we can unlock a copy of him, that way we can try him within the Abyssal Expedition. So we do have nine stones here, guys, and we get a copy of Brutus, got a copy of the Twins, very nice, got another copy of Grez, we got Morrow. So overall, pretty good on the pull right there. Anytime that we're picking up those Celestials or Hypogen heroes, and also is the resonating crystal guys that this has been locked for a considerable amount of time um need a couple copies of some heroes to continue building in here we have a ton of loot or a ton of essence ton of exp but we do not have the levels right now to continue building out these heroes so hoping really fingers crossed that we can pick up a couple more copies taking the twins to mythic plus really a big big upgrade right there Still have Theowin, we need copies. We have Pippa, um, a, a lot of heroes in here, but again, we need copies. We just built out Scarlet, which was awesome to see. I am hoping from these copies or from these scrolls that we're gonna be able to pull at least one copy of Aziz. I want to get one copy of him. That way we can continue to utilize him um, again within the Abyssal Expedition. Because remember, we are gonna get him at Legendary, which is gonna be very cool to see. Let's start off with our companion points here. First one gives us an elite, guys. Very nice, a copy of Thisu right there. Second pull, just some rare cards. Don't have enough for a third, but I'm hoping with six pulls here, because remember, guys, Awakened Heroes have a very, very low chance of coming up in here. But now that we have two Awakened Heroes that are available, um, chances are higher to pull them. I, I mean, anytime that you're adding more heroes in here, you are gonna have a higher probability, which there is a copy of Raku for us. Still hoping to pick one or two more copies of Scarlet out of here, which would be awesome to see. Another elite right there, which is Kren. He is very close as well. Final one gives us another elite. Very nice, it is a copy of Saurus. Um, card on the table, you can see they've actually changed a couple of the cards and how they look, which is pretty cool. So Raku, I think that is going to give us enough. Finally, our, our last one, if we are going Rangers within this Abyssal Expedition, absolutely going to have to have him up to Ascended. But with that Ascended Hero, it does give us five more levels here, guys, which is very cool. We can go ahead and add a little bit more on there. So one card on the table, again, looking for Light Bearers, um, looking to get some more levels with Belinda, looking to get a couple more copies of Scarlet. Hopefully it's gonna be one of those. It is Maro again. I'm not sure how far we've built out Maro, but we do have one pull here with our Light Bear cards, and it is a copy of Maro again. So double copies of Maro right there. Um, stargazing, we were looking for Scarlet. We didn't do any Stargazing for Scarlet, because I believe we were building out Frampton was the other hero that we were kind of looking at. So I'm gonna swap this over to Frampton, and we're just gonna let it, let it go. See if possibly we can get some copies. And I'm thinking though, is with Frampton, I'm gonna use my cards on Frampton. So we were building out Frampton. Um, I am gonna utilize my cards. I'm not gonna use my diamonds because I need heroes, guys. We're trying to gain some levels on here, which would really make a big difference. And look at the difference in the cards. Look at all the of the icons have pretty much changed. So that one's some pretty good loot. There's a copy of Frampton, very nice guys. Might be able to pull him to Mythic if we can get another copy, which there's just some more loot. Last copy here, last pull, just gives us some more loot. That's okay. Like I said, I, I want to go ahead and do some of the regular summons. Um, that way we have an opportunity to pull not only the copy of Aziz that we're looking for, but also we have an opportunity to build out more heroes that we need to continue to build up our levels. So some rare cards on our first pull. Second one gives us an Elite, which is another copy of Thisu. Might be able to build him out, um, which would be pretty cool to see, actually. A couple more rare cards there. Third one, which will give us an Elite. Just another single, but it is a copy of Damon. 
So very nice with that one. A lot of a lot of emblems right there. So Damon will actually add one more star. We almost have him completely maxed out. When we actually started this account, that was one of the very first heroes. And I'm going to use these last ones, guys, just because we have them. And I'm hoping that one will get another card, which we will very shortly by the time we're done with this one. But I'm also hoping that RNG somehow would bring up a legendary hero here. And unfortunately, that is not the case. Got a copy of Morio right there. That gives us another card on the table. So another chance to pick up Scarlet. And it's going to be interesting to see in the Abyssal Expedition, guys. Um, another copy of Morrow. Um, exactly how many heroes or, or what heroes are just going to be absolutely crazy. We got 23 cards. I have been buying these cards every day. And there we go, guys. I'm hoping with two 10 pulls that we're going to get at least a copy of him for the Abyssal Expedition. So the first one gives us just some loot. So unfortunately, we didn't get a card on there. We did get some 24-hour loot right there. Um, we've completed 3520. Oh, it just popped up. Poll number two. It is a copy. Yes, we got a copy. Very nice. Again, I, I know he's not going to be built, but I wanted to at least get a copy, at least get him unlocked, guys. Um, so we could definitely just try him out and see exactly how well he's going to work or, or see exactly what we can kind of use him for. Um, interesting to see. So we did get a copy of him. That, that's very cool. I wanted to make sure that we got a copy. We have a lot of heroes built on here. I wonder one, two, three. See, we only have three for Morrow. I've built up, again, a lot of heroes. I know we have quite a bit of food. No, I have Morrow. So we can actually take Morrow up. Um, another mage within here, definitely working on building Morrow up a little bit. Again, just because I, I'm going to go mage for the Abyssal Expedition. I'm not sure exactly how well it's going to go, um, but we are definitely going to have to see what we can build out. And we do have food down there, so where is Morrow? So he is, I swear we just, oh, moved him to the top. That's right. We have food, but I don't think we have enough for a second copy. But folks, we do not. We have the copies for him, but I don't have enough food for him. That is kind of where we're stuck with a lot of these heroes. Got a couple of copies of Thisu, a um, couple copies of Granite, a couple copies of Enoki. A lot of our regulars, guys, that we're just looking for more copies of. I'm going to have to really go through here and see who we can build, because this we have a ton of food. An insane amount of food actually on light bearers, but looking at having four copies of anyone. Because Pippa, we have one right there. We need more copies of Pippa. Cirrus, same thing. Um, we got copies of Lorzin. I don't think we have enough to build up Lorzin. Nope. And then we got Mishka right there. Theowin, I th thought we might have had copies of her. We have one. And same with Pharrell. Pharrell, we just have that one single copy there. Isabella, we have enough to build. Isold, we do not. We're really going to have to go through here and build out a couple of heroes, guys. And look how cool he looks. Guys, that is really, really cool looking hero. All right, Oaken. So again, I'm hoping to continue to build out Scarlet. Um, have 19,000. We have no furniture on her, but we have five cards on the table. So again, hoping that I could pull a couple pieces for her and get her maxed out. Since we didn't get lucky, there we go, guys. One piece for Scarlet. And again, we have a couple cards on the table. Want to build her out, really maximizing the damage in the Twist in Rome, maximizing the damage in a couple different things. And a double, guys, Damon and Merlin. Very nice pull right there. I've been saving a lot of these resources, um, just kind of sitting on them. Figured it was time to utilize so some of those. So. Smart selection, we'll go ahead, add him up. Damon is almost done, which is very nice to see. Recycle what we didn't use. I'm not sure if it's going to give us enough, just under enough. But we got five cards there, um, and that gives one copy for Scarlet. We have seven here, seven here, eight here. 
definitely going to be able to max a lot of those out. Um, I'm going to drop Taylene out of here. Zorath we're still building. Kren we're still building, which is good. A lot of these heroes we already do have kind of max out or built up a little bit. Um, most of the key ones we do have built as well. Not sure about regular Z's. We could do Tassie. Tassie can actually build up a little bit more. And then Merlin, we did get some furniture for. Um, we also do have the ability to level this up a little bit. This is what I've been kind of just sitting on resources. Because um, these levels are going to make a really big difference when it comes to the Abyssal Expedition that we're actually starting tomorrow. So we're, we're going to go through, um, do like a starter's guide and then do kind of a more advanced guide. For the abyssal expedition guys but that takes us to 380 i'm gonna have to go through see exactly what we can do for the levels um make a little progression in the campaign guys but that'll do it for today's video wanted to knock out some summons on the test server haven't done it in quite a bit and we do have aziz guys not only do we have the trial version um but what we do have our copy to go ahead and go mage within the abyssal expedition i cannot wait to see it and going all out mage we're going to go all relics for mage and see exactly how well we how well we do so guys let me know in the comments what you guys think and as always thank you guys for watching